degrees. I think you can create your own car company with $500 million. <laughs> but they have a great attitude. What I meant was th they say their life won't change all that mm -hmm. much. That's really a smart move. Yeah. Just enjoy it, put it away. You know, it, it's there for those emergencies. Yeah, you stuff. remember all the stories of right. like, if you go crazy, how it can end really bad. You don't want to do that. Right. And it's going to be a different night, especially in comparison to the last two balmy nights we've had here in San Diego tonight. Not as busy in Coronado. Although there are still some people enjoying the evening, it's still pretty nice out there. You travel a few miles off the road and you're going to find very different weather since rain is already moving into the county. The temperatures are dropping. It's getting cooler between 10 to 15 degrees, cooler than 24 hours ago. And here's what we are expecting. Light rain and strong winds. How much rain? Anywhere from a tenth of an inch to about three quarters of an inch. The timing tonight into tomorrow. Snow levels will be well out of our area, above 7,000 feet. The mountains gusty winds there between 20 and 30 miles an hour. Gust as high as 60 and tomorrow morning will be the time with the strongest winds. Our pinpoint uh, rain future cast here showing you how it's going to be a lot more widespread as we head into tomorrow. The main core of the system is well to the north and when the energy stretches out from the frontal boundary that makes it a lot weaker and in result we get much lighter amounts of rainfall. That's why they're going to see a lot more up north. But there could be some pretty steady rain showers and that could create some slowdowns tomorrow morning. So I would advise you to take your time on the roads right now. As we speak already, we have to do that from Oceanside to Encinitas. You can see that rain is starting to get um, actually propagate and move farther inland right along the 15 already starting to see some of the showers from Valley Center into Escondido as we zoom south and Sanita is also getting a touch of rain here in San Diego. Not much. It'll be right around 714 before we start to see that next cell moving into Chula Vista tonight. Temperatures will be right around 49 at Poway 51 Ramona looking at 60 in San Diego because of all the clouds. Temperatures will not be as cold overnight and then tomorrow mid 60s as we make our way along the 15. Poway 68, 69 El Cajon and 68 in Chula Vista. But remember, gusty winds expected into the mountains early in the morning. A wind advisory in effect until 1 o'clock in the afternoon for the mountains and deserts. TGIT tomorrow, 67 degrees with morning showers becoming drier on Friday, Friday and then warming things up over the weekend. Next week, we'll shift back to our offshore flow and that means hotter temperatures coming back next week. So enjoy the cool down because 90s are on track for early next week and for tonight, rain, which we have been hoping, keeping our fingers crossed, doing our rain dance and it's not <laughs> happening, but it's going to be a light event. Still be careful on the roads. You need yeah. to dance more. Yeah, yeah. If we can more get dancing. a little. We'll take it. Yeah. That'd be nice. <laughs>